Today, more Operation Anti Spook in the ACT. Hello again, it's Martin North from Digital Finance Analytics. Welcome to this post covering finance and property news with a distinctively Australian flavour. Well, Cookie Boy has been a very busy boy. He's been throwing me lots of data points showing more price reductions from the property portals. So today we're going to walk through some more examples and also supplement that with the latest from our core market models, which is data up to the end of November. Now, in the new format, we're not going to walk through each one in detail, but we are going to display the price reductions and also the extracts from the models. And you can pause if you like to look in more detail at the data as we go. And it's worth saying, of course, that this is not necessarily a scientifically selected or statistically representative example. It's merely that these are the price reductions currently being reported. And while well, the reductions are accelerating both in terms of quantum and also in terms of count. So let's get going. But before we start, a quick reminder, if you are interested in a detailed conversation about a suburb, you can actually engage me via my one-to-one -one service. I'll put the details below in the link. And that allows us not to give you financial advice, but to give you information from our models as to what may be happening down on the ground. And I'll also remind you that tomorrow evening, Tuesday, you'll be able to watch my latest live show. And in that show, I'll be talking about the latest in terms of mortgage stress and household scenarios. And also we can look at the core market models and do some deep dives there too. So there's plenty of opportunity to engage with me around this research. Anyway, let's get on now and walk through these specific examples. And once again, many thanks to Cookie Boy.
there you have it, the latest from our core market models. Many thanks to Cookie Boy for providing the underlying data. This is Martin North from Digital Finance Analytics. I'll see you next time.